Little in fishing is more iconic than the, the sight of a float darting out of sight. There's a lot of questions about what size or style of float to use and answering those questions, uh, one of the best starting points for that is looking at the basic functions of a float. Uh, first, a float uh, suspends a bait at a measured distance. Second, a float gives you casting weight. When you're using a really small offering, maybe a, a micro jig that's hard to cast, you can cast it accurately when you're using a float. A float lets you see what's going on underneath the water, whether that's just uh, the fish are just sort of nibbling or whether it darts underneath, lets you know when to set the hook. So when you Consider those basic functions of a float and consider the circumstance and adjust accordingly that it makes it a lot easier for you to pick the right size float any given day.